Hey guys, Kid Guru here. Today I have a tutorial on uh, jailbreaking the iPhone 3G. This is running 3.0 firmware. So this is my iPhone. Mine's already jailbroken. This is my friend's iPhone, right there. We're gonna be jailbreaking his. So uh, yeah, we're gonna be using Red Snow. So we're just gonna set it all up here. Um, yeah. So this is the iPhone Dev Team blog. So uh, just download Red Snow here. I'll have a link in the video description. And let's get started. So I already have the folder extracted. Here, can you hold this? I'm just focus it on the screen while I do this. So you gotta plug it in first. You get your iPod charger. Let's yeah, run it. So you're gonna first it's gonna ask you to browse for the what do you call that? The IPSW file, which is the 3.0 firmware. You're gonna have to download that too, unless you already have it. So it's gonna process the firmware. So you have to give it a second. And it's identified, so we're going to go next. It's patching the kernel. You can probably jailbreak this all in like five minutes, so it shouldn't take too long. It's going to patch. So here's the iPhone. Preparing the RAM disk. Alright, we're going to install City on it so you can get some cool applications. Okay, now you're going to go into DFU mode. This is pretty. As soon as you hit next, you got to be ready to do a couple things. So first, hold down the power button for one second. Without releasing, hold down the home button. Three seconds without releasing the home button. Hold the okay, yeah, hold the whole button for 30 seconds. Oh, I think I might have done this wrong. I think I'm supposed to turn the phone off first. Okay, no, there you go. It's doing fine. It's gonna reboot the phone now. So it's all really simple, just using red snow. You get the white screen. Should go to the Apple logo in a couple seconds. Uploading third stage. Logo to downloading the jailbreaking data. By this time, you can let go of the home button and power button. After this, it should be finished. After a couple steps. And this voids your warranty, so if you ever screw up your phone, you have to restore it. If you have to like bring it into the store, you probably won't. <laughs> yeah. It's rebooting the phone, and it's done, so. Just gotta let the thing load right there. It's all it takes to jailbreak it, so we're just gonna wait a couple seconds as it reboots the phone. Let it go, do its thing. Downloading jailbreaking data. And after this, you'll have City installed so you can download all your, uh, you know, whatever you need to download. Winter board, etc. Okay, so now you get the little logo of the pineapple. Flashing noir. So I'm just gonna. <laughs> SpongeBob says. <house. laughs> Almost done. After this, it should be done. Just gonna reboot one more time and we'll be good to go. Actually, here, we're gonna stop the clip and then let it finish this credit and stop it. I'll stop it. We'll bring it back when it's done. Okay, so we're back here and now it's rebooting. And then it reboots, you should, still ha you should have in city, uh, city, uh, So here's my iPhone over here. Uh, you're gonna get this little city, uh, installer, sorry. Oh, one second, I gotta turn my iPhone back on. You get this little city installer right here, and you can download your applications and jailbroken stuff. So, yeah. Just gonna let it sit there. And that was all under what, like five minutes, maybe? Around there. Doesn't take too long. Okay, so it's about to boot in. Mm hmm. Let him enter his passcode. Oh, you didn't lose any data, did you? Everything's still there, right? Yeah. And then right there, City is installed, so we're just gonna click it. And it's good to go, it's jailbroken, so now I'm just gonna connect to my Wi Fi. Alright, so it's all good. Um, we're jailbroken, that's all it takes. All you have to do is install Red Snow on the computer. And wait, right here, let's bring this over here. So I'm gonna leave you a link to download Red Snow for Mac or for. Uh, 
windows that way you can easily uh, jailbreak your iPhone and that happened really quick so be aware if anything happens to your phone because you are avoiding your warranty you can easily restore it to the 3.0 firmware and it won't be jailbroken anymore and you can bring it into Apple or whatever your carrier if you need to get it like fixed or something so guys that's it hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I'm gonna go ahead and install some apps for Cydia so thanks